This is Renewable Hydropower Energy by Maddie O, Will K, and Eva E. Here's how it works. From far away, it just looks like a waterfall, but it's much more than that. When the water moves through the dam, the water makes energy. It spins a turbine that goes to a generator. After the water goes through the dam, it goes through these steps. After it goes downwards, it is pushed to spin a turbine, which goes to a generator, goes to a transformer, and then goes to power lines. Hydropower energy is mainly produced in the United States, China, Russia, and Brazil. 51% of hydropower energy in the United States is produced in Washington, California, and Oregon. Washington produces the most because of the Grand Coulee Dam. New York produces the most hydropower energy east of the Mississippi. Did you know that one-fifth of the world's energy is hydropower? The best locations to produce this energy in the United States are located in the West. One of the reasons for this is because there is room for the large government-run facilities that produce hydropower energy. Another reason is because there are several rivers in the West that help to produce this energy. So advantages are, it is a natural resource, the water they use is absolutely free, and no greenhouse gases get emitted into our atmosphere. It is extremely cost-effective to power. Hydropower produces clean energy with no pollution. Some more advantages are, the resources are very easy to obtain to build dams, and rivers are everywhere and very reliable. Some disadvantages are that the dams are expensive to build, the nearby area is flooded so it affects wildlife, and other disadvantages are, some of these power plants only work for 20 to 30 years, and these dams can obstruct fish migration. This was Hydropower Energy. The end.